watch the camera put 50 pounds on me. Lead. Lead. This mohawk ain't working out on TV. Hey, welcome to the Chill Spot. I'm Corinne. I'm Lisa. Welcome back to the show again. Yes, thank you Glad for having me. Friday, October 25th. I know. Where's Can the you month going? I don't know. It's going by fast. Before we fast. know it, there's going to be the white stuff falling. I'm ready for it. Yeah. It's better than the tornadoes. Oh, yeah. yeah. But before we talk about this, you had some exciting events happen last week. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, had my son get married. Mm -hmm. Big wedding, lots of people, lots of company, and yeah. beautiful event. and Beautiful uh, pictures. Yeah, so they've been together for so long, it just seemed like a big party, <laughs> not a wedding so much. Cause, because, you know, they say you're accepting your daughter-in-law into your family, but she's just right. been a part of our family for so long. For a long time. Yeah, as a matter of fact, many of our members probably would recognize her because she mm -hmm. helped it at conference and CNA Fest in the past. She wasn't able to this year because she had to save her days off from work for her wedding and honeymoon, go figure. <laughs> but um, <clears throat> she used to volunteer usually with the sales mm -hmm. table. And of course, everybody knows Matthew Cantrell. And yep. yep, yep, they'll be taking their honeymoon later in November. Later so. in November. So we just want to send out a big congratulations um, to them and um, Welcome to the family, Jade, even though you've been here for a while, but <laughs> welcome. <laughs> welcome back. Yep. Well, tomorrow is National Make a Difference Day, so that's what we're going to talk about. I love that. Yeah. It started in 1992 when actually the second largest newspaper wanted their readers and customers to make a difference, to do something for mankind or out in their community. Mm -hmm. And um, I noticed when I was doing the research on here, in 1992, it was a leap year. Oh. So I'm assuming that's why they started it, because it gave you an extra day right. to, do, to right. do something. Huh. So it's just a way to give back, um, show your, your talents. And I know we have a lot of members out there that are talented in many different oh, things. Absolutely. So we want to see those talents. Some of them uh, legal and just some kidding. of them non-legal. <laughs> I'm just teasing. Well, there could be some non-legal Well, you know, there's just so there. many ways to make mm -hmm. a difference to people. There and um, I'm somebody that I um, always... You know, we're always so quick to complain if we mm -hmm. get bad food or bad service at a restaurant or something like that. But right. I always try to, if I have exceptional service or something like that, I always try to recognize that. I mean, the other day at Walmart, you know, Walmart's got us all <laughs> where we have to go there for everything, it seems like. But yeah. the other day at Walmart, I just had the nicest cashier you know they try to funnel you to the automated lines mm -hmm. and i don't like those it makes me nervous when the machine's saying put your item in the bag <laughs> you know it keeps flashing that on the screen and then i can't I get go flushed. fast enough i just can't do it so i have to wait for <laughs> wait in line for a real live person to check my mm -hmm. stuff out and she was a young lady but she was just so nice and helpful and she had been really kind to an elderly man that was in front of me that had problems with his you know trying to figure his. out his card and then he couldn't remember his pen anyway i was impressed so i had to stop on the way out and tell him that the gal that on she line had. Yeah. Four was And awesome they probably thought you were going to come to them and complain. Probably, probably. Yeah. But little things can make such a big it difference does. to people. Yeah. yeah. So if you have um, any special talents, we want to hear from you. Um, if you love writing, I know Lisa would love to uh, have you jot down your CNA story and send it to her. Absolutely. Yeah. We Absolutely. would still like to receive some of those and just try to make a difference. I know as a CNA, you make a difference every day, but just pay attention, um, especially tomorrow, on the little um, details. If something pops on, into your mind that's telling you to go back to that resident's room, go back to that resident's room and remember, you know, even if you get the feeling like, 
you didn't say good morning or mm -hmm. you didn't straighten the collar on his shirt. Mm -hmm. If that pops up into your mind, that's a sign to go back there and just, just do the right thing. And just a little bit of kindness can go a long way. That's I think. right. That's mm -hmm. right. It does. It does. So that's all I have, unless you have anything. Oh, hashtag us and let us know um, what kind of extra thing that you did, you know, to make a difference that day yeah. and make sure you send your stories um, and just be you. Yeah. Um, you're already amazing, so That's just right. be you. And it doesn't have to be yeah. a huge action to make a difference. The yeah. littlest thing, even a compliment, yeah. can really brighten someone's day. Telling them that you like their shoes or something like that, you know, it can just make a real difference. Yep. And uh, you ready? Yep. Until we see you again, remember, you, you matter. matter.